So I also want to talk about a few features that are not available inside the sequence tool and uh, some of the nice features available in other commercial uh, diagramming tools is that the the, uh, the sequence diagrams are capable of showing some extra notation for creating and deleting participants. So let's take a look an ex uh, at the example. So right here uh, we have this example of uh, creating and deleting a participant and to create a participant uh, the message uh, like new can go directly into um, into the participant box display, right? So here uh, we have some sort of uh, a method uh, uh, already actively running. And when we say new, so instead of uh, showing it like we did over here below the box uh, showing the participant, uh, the new uh, arrow goes directly into the box. So that's kind of like highlights the fact that this participant appears to be a little bit later on. There could be some disadvantages to this as well, because in this sort of notation, we can quickly browse through the list of participants. In this situation, we kind of have to like, like look for them, especially again, if this is a larger and more complicated display, it can be a little bit more difficult to uh, just to browse visually uh, through these things. But uh, this is available. Um, and uh, a message name is optional um, if using constructor. Uh, it's again, it's nicely marked as new right here. And the deletion of the participant like this is indicated by an X sign like this. And you see that, uh, for instance, we create a new object. We, 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 we call a method in this object. The method returns. And then uh, we call into this object again and say close. And this close uh, self destroys this object. So if we just want to show that the lifeline of this object is actually ending here, the object will no longer be available anywhere else in the system. We can use an X to display, uh, display its, uh, its um, disappearance, basically removal from memory. Because again, remember, these things that we show inside sequence diagrams are objects in memory, real objects allocated, uh, allocating and, and consuming uh, physical space in memory. Also, at the end of the call, when we have this return back to the caller, we can also display that the object may self self-distract. Right, so the self delete and basically the object may decide that they, uh, the object may want to go out of scope. It's possible um, by using the delete uh, operator in C++, um, but it's also uh, very common to show it like this uh, in Java environment uh, where actually this is done by the garbage collect, uh, collector uh, thread of uh, Java uh, virtual machine. So uh, this is the so these are basically features uh, of the lifeline because we say that the name of the participant uh, starts at the head at the top right here starts the the actual lifeline so here and here we have these additional features which we can use uh, with uh, participants in our uh, sequence uh, diagrams.